Hello. How y'all doing, folks? Can you hear me? My voice might sound a bit rough. It's because uh, I've been gradually becoming more ill every time I play this game. Hey, oh, folks. How y'all doing? This game is making you sick. Yeah, don't buy it. Do not purchase this game. It's absolutely awful. Uh, but I'm back today for more suffering, because I hate myself. Uh, we're going to play more Detective Pikachu. I'm, I'm just messing with you. We're going to play some more Detective Pikachu. Uh, because we're going to go through it so no one else has to play this game. What do you do? This game, this game is so bad. It's just, it's just so awful. Do not purchase it. Just watch the movie. There's literally no reason for this to exist. This is one of the worst games I've ever played in my life. Would you say it's worse than Minecraft Story Mode? Yeah. Yeah. It's, it, it's there. At least that was kind of comically awful. This is just awful. <laughs> it's not even any relief. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna play it. We're back today to suffer. Give people a chance to hop on into the stream. I'm just kind of sitting tight here. How y'all doing? I hope y'all having a good weekend. Happy Canadian Thanksgiving. It's our Thanksgiving weekend. Our day. The family's having turkey back home. Hi, I'm here for the divorce. Are we also at risk of getting infected from watching the game? If you do get sick after watching this stream, I apologize. We have it on record that this game is now more painful than giving birth to a child. Um, a new... Uh, a mother has confirmed this. On our stream. So... We're gonna... We're gonna keep enduring it. I actually got sick after the first year. Do you think the game did this? Yep. Yep, absolutely. That's why you're sick. But yeah, we're almost uh, 12 hours into the adventure. 11 and a half. We're on the final chapter, thank God. Um, so we're going to finish and lay the nightmare the rest. Um, because I've been so sick from playing this game, I'm probably going to have to take time off next week because I played this. <laughs> Says everything. I'm going to have to probably rest up after this. It really describes the experience. Uh, but I'm I want to finish it today because, God forbid, I take time off and rest and come back and have to endure more of this. So, you know, I'm just going to get it done. Watch party. I haven't had time to set up the watch party for um, actually watching Detective Pikachu, but we will try and do that at some point. We'll try and do that at some point. Because I think that'd actually be kind of fun. It is on Amazon, which means we can do it on Twitch. Uh, there is a way to do it. So that might be fun. But for now, um, let's dive back into this hellscape. <sighs> You're all very welcome. Thanks for keeping me company. Thanks for enduring this with me. We want to see how this wraps up with divorce. Thank you everyone subbing off the bat. It's good to have you all here. Whoa, what? Oh, right. That's as good as it gets, folks. <laughs> oh, you didn't see it. Sorry, Pikachu was just falling over. Detective audiobook. It might be a better experience. Oh, look, there's a pizza we made. <laughs> the bamboo charcoal pizza we brought back from Bamboo Borough. We're sure making mean pie. Sure do. Super Jazz of the Manager, thank us for helping with our free pizza. The left us from yesterday. Maybe I'll have a nibble before we head out. Okay, let's check the, oh. the newspaper. The, there's no headlines today. The headlines is literally look at this Pikachu. Tim 
shocked expression, and by the way, someone made pizza. Really slow news day. This was a great detective pizza chew. Mm -hmm. Made the front page Pikachu. Taking a break after eating all the at the pizzeria in Bamboo Borough. It was nice of the compass some pizza. Thanks for carrying the charcoal. You have to eat that many slices, Pikachu. Cut me some slack. Set the moving bowls for Pangora, and I stopped that golem from rolling right at us too. Kind of strenuous activity works up the appetite, you know. Front page news. Apparently wrapped into a fucking moral teaching for the kids. Don't eat too much pizza. Okay. I mean, something so delicious is way more dangerous if you ask me. Okay, alright. Pikachu ate pizza. Vigilant Gumshoe stops a robber. We prevented a crime. Huh? There was a robbery in Bamboo Burrow. At the curry joint. Looks like they caught the robber right away. Look who stopped the robber. It was that Gumshoes we met. Oh, she's really took a liking to those curry buns. If we did not help them, they would have lost everything they own. Family would have lost all their finances. Could sunlight be the link between Blossom's dancing and weather? <laughs> Groundbreaking new research in the field of Pokemon science. This is because we helped find two of them on the street. Not seeing any of this game, what is happening. So basically, if you go out of your way to complete optional objectives that take a long time to complete, uh, you get newspaper articles. There's no picture or anything, it's just all text. Because God forbid, there's a reward <laughs> for playing the game. This is as good as it gets. You get to read the paper. Territorial disputes reveal relationships with bug Pokemon. Mm -hmm. Even more research. This is the Heracross and Vikavolt. Like, sure. Bro, Vikavolt, the ecosystem, blah. Pinter and Heracross are teaming up. Okay. Nah, uh, I'm... Yeah, sure. Latest restaurant review from Bamboo Burrow. <laughs> they would have got a terrible, like, closing them out of business Ratatouille-ass review. If they, if we didn't help them, because we helped make the curry. When this game even release? Two days ago. <laughs> huh? You'd be mistaken if you thought it was two thousand and three. Yamper Hell Regiment. I wonder how that works. If the Yamper zaps you, electricity loosens the knots on your shoulders. Okay, new groundbreaking Yamper research. You should walk with a dog. That's good for your health. And Pikachu does not like this idea. Great Detective Pikachu. Oh, there's so many of these. Rumored mythical Pokemon finally found. This is the- what, what- what do we do to, to help her? No one's actually seen it clearly. There's supposed to be people peeking into the tall grass and they had a sound and find nothing but a hole in the ground. We did see a shadowy shape leap away from them though. Oh, this is just Bunnelby. No, it's Dunsparce, sorry. Okay. Dunsparce is a legendary Pokemon. Weekly book review, the Farfetch'd Tale. Do, do we even want to read these? <laughs> Let's just cross off the crossword. Because this this is literally the quiz answers that we already solved. And it like regurgitates even the same dialogue from solving it. Dad's so proud of you, son. Could be so dramatic. Those fake tears are a bit much even for you. He's acknowledging Pikachu's acknowledging he's our father. Mm -hmm. Here's a book. I don't know about a book that's coming out. The Farfetch'd Tale. What's it about? Star Wars fantasy novel about a Surfetch. The Wander Warriors are fetching marks on a long journey full of chance encounters and fairy wells. You'll laugh, you'll cry. You'll take your receipt back to GameStop. This adventure story is one for an age. It's like a pretty tale. Those are fetch we met in the bamboo forest ever went on the journey like that. No ordinary Pokemon, I can tell you that. 
Yeah, let's probably set on a new adventure with Ponyard. Oh, speed rankings. Rock lock fly, fly over 120 miles per hour. Fastest Pokemon alive has just been found. Oh. Pikachu look-alike contest. Little Fountain Plaza mostly credits and entered a partner Pokemon into the contest. We actually entered themselves, decked out in homemade Detective Pikachu costumes. Like, this would just be such a great opportunity to even have just a screenshot or something. This sounds really cute. I would love to see it. But like, it's just text description. Even if it was just like a, a cute photo, that would be enough of a reward. But like, they really, really did not want to try. <laughs> it's part of the DLC. Disco Dan, thank you for 100 bits. Herity is one of the three people that, who liked Fallout 76. Here to say that even I cannot enjoy this game. Well, that, that's speaking volumes. Oh my god. What hope is there? <laughs> bamboo charcoal pizza we brought back from bamboo burr. Should make a mean pie. Oh, I already had this dialogue. I don't even want to talk to my family because I just think they're AI generated. Like, if I talk to, like, my sister, she's gonna be, Wow, Pikachu's looking cute today with his hat. Did you have a good time in the forest? Boy, that was a mean pizza you brought home. Pikachu seems different from his usual self. Different how? It just seems like he's got, I don't know, old man energy now. What? Really? He's always seemed like that to me. Pikachu is getting tired. Uh, not old. Experienced, like an experienced great detective. Am I really acting older since I got my memories back? The crap it old man, Pikachu. <laughs> well, that was a scene. Oh no, is Pikachu depressed? No, Sophia, that's me. <laughs> Okay, let's just, let's just, let's just go. Mm -hmm. Time to get going. Yep, let's mosey. Okay, there's something I gotta do. I'll meet you there. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> You'll like it, I promise. Pikachu's got a plan. Oh, that's right. We're out of coffee beans. Can you pick some up? Okay. The usual dark roast, right? That's just like, yeah. why is it like a, huh? just a void outside our home? Sophia, <laughs> you can... Uh-huh. I've understood you this whole time. <laughs> oh my god. Now that's my little girl. Uh, why didn't she say anything? Okay, okay, okay. See you later. Why, why did she not say anything? Hmm? Why would she hide that? Okay, alright. Well, we'll just keep going. Why did you not say anything? <laughs> What's the point? Hmm. I'm getting this game from my younger cousin to show them that there is no god in this world. <laughs> oh, that's mean. Do not buy this as presents for like your relatives. Just don't. Dude, just don't just don't buy it. Don't even pirate it. Don't it's not even worth pirating. Like, just don't do it. Your time is a resource. Spend it wisely. <sighs> this is Pokemon Unity Lab. Yeah, it's definitely where Mama used to work. There's where Unitas Bases is. Well, Herb, it seems too quiet, doesn't it? Emperor, thank you for 1050 bits. I wish Darkrai would engulf this world in the Nightmare Void, but this game is already a nightmare. Yeah, we live in hope. Thank you. We are nowhere near as weird as Pikachu actually being your dad. I'm still trying to wrap my head around that. When did we tell Rachel this? She she left. We 
Talked about that in confidence, but okay. Body's supposed to be around here somewhere, right? Rachel's not supposed to know that Pikachu's our dad. But anyway. Look around our ourselves for a bit while we wait for Pikachu. I'm curious about what's inside. Okay. Let's go. She watched the movie. <laughs> she got spoiled. Oh, uh, look at him go. It's the game. Garba. He's chatting his partner. Okay, he's just hanging out. This is a metaphor for the quality of the product you purchased. Think that's cute. Dig. See any suspicious looking people around here? I don't speak Pokemon. Okay, let's go for our speed run. Look at Tangla go. I mean, these are cute. I, I like these bits where you like interact with the Pokemon. And they get like little descriptions and that. It's just funny and cute. I like when you're actually investigating the scene too. Excuse me. This I hate. Dips, thank you for a thousand bits. Just join considering the title. I guess you're enjoying the game a lot. You know it. I need to interview the janitor. What do you know about the lab? It's closed since the hour incident. There are four entrances in total. Okay, we were the first people you've seen here. You know how few people came here. Excuse me. You know anything about the incident that happened here? When I saw the news, the Pokemon went completely berserk here two years ago because of our stuff. I heard someone actually died because of it. It's a really tragic story. That yeah, is. It's been shut down ever since. Rachel's nonchalant. That's her mum who died, but she lacks all emotion. Excuse me. <sighs> that's a that's a mid dialogue. Excuse me. Usually someone comes by to take over one of my shifts, but otherwise it's pretty much just me. Mm -hmm. Go take a look at the building in a mo. Door, okay, door's locked. Door's also locked. Hang on, we can investigate this. Pokemon Unity Lab. This door is also locked. What's going on? Shouldn't be overheard here. Yeah, don't- there's literally no one here. They couldn't afford to render more than one NPC. The building's definitely locked, so we had to get inside. Not much to go on right now. Anything else? We need to talk to the Pokemon. All we can do now is wait for Pikachu. It looks like he's late. What do you think Pikachu's up to? Tim, uh, why are you still calling your father Pikachu? Well, it's hard for me to call him dad to his face. He is a Pikachu. I mean, he still looks like a Pikachu. When you put it like that, it does sound awkward. There he is! Hey! Sorry for the wait! Oh, he brought all our friends. What, why is it like a barren wasteland out there in the background? What? We're in, we're in the desert? I thought we were in a city. You all came to help. Thank you. Wow, Pikachu, you have so many friends. This ragtag crew is my entourage. Whoa, what? Did I miss something? Oh, Pikachu said- that... Tim, there's no time for that. We got work to do. Okay. Sure. It's very oh. urgent. But wait a second, Pikachu. Something's odd about this place. Didn't find any signs of their activity. This is what I've learned from our Pokemon. This place seems like our strongest lead. Okay, we'll, we'll find them. Already finished the preliminary investigation. 
talk to the Pokemon. Okay, Rachel, you just you just do whatever you're doing. And all the Pokemon are gonna hang here too. Let me talk to the garbage again. How about you, Garbador? Trying to pick up trash. Sounds like you're a hard worker. Wouldn't he create more of a mess himself? He's going to be praised just for collecting snacks. Yeah, he's, he's just eating the garbage. Hmm. You see any other humans here? Garbo. Can we get in? Garbo. You know what's anything strange? Does he find strange snacks? One of the snacks he found today. It's a food wrapper. Okay. Oh, you use food wrapper be here if people don't come here. You find these all the time. It's like, my god. There's a McDonald's takeout in that bush. Give him some utter rubbish in exchange for this rubbish. Diglett, what you got for us? Hmm. What do you know, Diglett? He just likes digging here. I have especially of Diglett, the soil is always perfectly tilled after you dig through it. That's cute. Be afraid to visit places with humans around. Diglett hasn't seen any people around, but I did mention something pretty interesting. So the night when Diglett's underground trying to sleep, and hears a lot of noise. Curious about the noise and went into its building to check it out, but no one was there. Someone, someone just left the fridge running. Dug a hole through the floor of the building. Okay. We gotta check that out. Tangla, what do you know? Hey! What do you do for fun around here? Play another game, eh? That sounds nice. Dang. Never seen any other people around here besides the janitor. Wait a second, there's something caught in Tangela's vines. Shards of glass, oh god. <laughs> they may have gotten anywhere near inside the building. But Tangela is like gonna bleed out. Oh Jesus. How'd you get inside, Tangela? Doors next to us. Why we need a cutscene for that? Yeah, they're locked now. It's as if they're operating here. Maybe we can find a way in after all. Well, well doors are definitely the ones Tangler told us about. Yeah, no shit, Pikachu. Chain something on the other side, keeping them open. And they're locked from the inside. What's going on? These doors were unlocked until recently. God, it's strange how people lock doors, ain't it? Who locked them? Wow. The units are here. There's noise, the door is locked, and there's a food wrapper. I think it's gonna be the do some time first. How do we get in? Uh, can we just throw a brick through the window? Like... Hmm. Find a hole. I, I, I think, I think we're supposed to do this. Okay. We gotta find, trace it back to McDonald's. Follow the scent. Pikachu, use brick. Oh. Yeah, it's time to ask each Pokemon for their help, solving a vital part of the story. Why they're here. Mm -hmm. Let's go, Growlithe. Oh, the scent from the small doors. Ooh. 
Look at them go. Old R to sniff. <laughs> Just like real animals. Scent suddenly disappeared. What's going on past the drums? Mm -hmm. There's no way to get back there to search. We can, we can just walk between them. Okay. All right, we're gonna just destroy them. Ask a Pokemon for help. Just Darmanitan, just destroy him. I hope there's explosives in them. <laughs> oh my god! That's really their secret entrance? It's just a massive gaping hole in the wall? Really? <laughs> Why? Okay, well, not throws me inside from out. You two can just wait here. There's just a massive fucking hole in the wall. Why don't Why don't they just lock the door? Why do they need a hole in the wall? Okay, the lab is messed up. But look, there's a McDonald's wrapper here. Someone ate a Big Mac here recently. This where the Pokemon went berserk during the Iron Institute two years ago. Why there's a hole in the wall and the room's in such disarray. This must have been left as it was was at the time of the incident. And it must have been. Okay, Rachel, if being here is too painful, it's totally fine if you want to wait outside. Okay, she, oh, she's actually expressing emotion. My god. This is new to Tim. He would have preferred to steer clear of this place. All signs point to Unitas being here. Start looking for clues. It felt strange I came to this room. Could that have been? Oh! Okay. Another McDonald's wrapper. They don't use wrappers for Big Macs. These must have been cheeseburgers. A clue. My god, that's some detective work right there. Quarter pounder. Oh. These are Tangler's footprints. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Five signs must have used this cupboard. What's up there? Wait a second, I'm looking. It's just chemicals. What's this? It's the key to the door. Why even leave this here? Hmm. What's the point? <sighs> Dangerous chemicals. Oh! It's stained. It kind of looks like a chemical spill. Some chemical spill during the Pokemon rampage. It's a smile. Dusty is. I'm guessing this isn't a recent stain. Ah, Sammy, thanks for 100 bits. Reminder, this game is £40 while the Ace Attorney bundle, which contains five games, is £50, only £10 more. What a scam this game is. Yep. <sighs> Everything's a mess. Oh! No electricity. Who would do this? There's a note here. From the management team regarding search procedures. On discovery of the object in question, collect it immediately. The object is collected, use concrete to seal off the first floor hallway. So we have the following. Destroy the switchboard on the first floor. Don't leave any trash behind such as food or drink containers. Also, you know, make sure to, like, burn these instructions when you're done. Do the build stop update state. Watch your steps as you move about. I 
Okay. Well. We'll find our way. They seal the hallway with concrete. Search for clues about Unitas. I think I can unlock the door. Hmm. I guess I lost the demand of my Pangoro can get in here. Here it goes. My god. The lock despawned. Just blipped out of existence. Hmm. Very clear someone's been coming in here. Because I know we know it had a purpose for doing so. It's deducing time. Hmm. What happened in this building? Tell me those Pokemon couldn't fit through the giant hole. Apparently hmm. not. So what happened? Somebody sealed off a hallway in the back? Yeah, it's that one. Someone was researching our- look at the big smile on this guy's face. Place being used as a Pokemon playground. My god. Someone's living here. Oh god. I was just squatting. Okay. Makes sense with the barrels. Oh god. Excuse me, I'll just blow my nose real quick. Detective Pikachu takes on the homeless crisis. Now there's a game. Okay, it's a hallway. Let's just start punching the walls. Hmm. Probably ask one of our friends for help. Is it the bit of wall? That's different color differently. We can't ask our Manitan for help, apparently. Oh, we need to see through the wall. Doesn't even let us select the wrong Pokemon. My god. Punch it. Please smash a suspicious looking wall over there. Let it rip, Darmatitan. Hmm. Thank god it broke so cleanly. Let's all keep going. It's a whole ha hallway hidden behind that wall. Yeah, now they're okay with um, with property damage and structural damage. Before they were like, no, wait, what if the building falls down? Just start punching. Hmm. I don't know if there's any side quests here. We haven't got any so far. It's actually a bit unusual. Most chapters are like, here's a mission. We had like 10 in the last chapter. Main story climax. Look at them walking. <laughs> they're, they're literally on the on the spot. Hmm. I realize this place is such a big basement. What's above us aren't in use anymore. It looks like look, like this one is. Let's uncover their secret. We're getting close to my body. Apparently, I wonder if Mewtwo's power has anything to do with it. One more thing. It's like Pikachu's consciousness has grown weaker inside me. Maybe because I know who I am. Again, memories and all. I don't know how long Pikachu can hold out, so we can't afford to dawdle. Pikachu's going to die if we're not quick. Oh, they're trying to stay secret, but thank God they have this whole intercom system. How did I get down here on a regular basis? Did it just destroy the wall every time? Did I have to just like repair that now? Okay, alright, everyone's going to the bottom floor. 
an alternate entrance. But if they have an alternate secret entrance, why do they not just use that? Tim, can we talk? Oh, it is a picture. Tim, you know how Sophia said she could understand what I was saying all along? I wonder why she never brought it up. Yeah, me too, Pikachu. That's a pretty big plot hole. Oh! There's a terminal here. We need to get a passcode. Hey, three, thank you for a thousand bits. Warning, you are now entering a narrative dead zone. Are you sure what you are doing is worse? We must continue. Wait, Tim. Let's hide and see what happens. They'll never see us here. Hey, did you remember to turn in the Aurora drop? <coughs> oh, excuse me. Yeah, I just dropped it off. Wasn't easy to get, though. Kramer just refused to cough it up. What are you all doing here? The mayor is here today to inspect the production line. Oh, my God. No slacking off. It yes, was the mayor all along. You, come with me. I need somebody to help set up on floor B5. Ma'am. You two, stand by on this floor until further notice. Copy, Copy that. that. What, a, what a poor reveal for the twist. Hey. Just like nonchalant, like in dialogue. About the aura drop in the production line. Office here to conduct an inspection. Mayor might still be on floor B5. Let's head down there and see if we can catch him. Gotta be careful, there's still some unit has goons on this floor. Oh! Okay, maybe we can just get the elevator. We need the key. They aren't even shocked. Oh. Oh! Uh, we gotta investigate the map. JF, thanks for a thousand bits. Hi, RT. I want to thank you for playing this game. So I know to steer clear of it like the plague. Thank you for making this experience entertaining, and I hope you feel better soon. Thank you very much. Okay. Hmm. Can't use the elevator. Search the floor for a passcode. If only I could walk to the left. Thank you. Hmm. Let me just run down another hey. hallway. Can I go in? Hmm. No. Um, maybe they just put the passcode up on a poster. And staff will be going in and out of rooms at night. There was no reason given for that one. Just something fell over. Oh. Pasco is available in the standby room. You're gonna need to make a deduction where it's like, ha ha! This is how oh. we get the passcode. Pokemon can escape. There's no warn people do not let any Pokemon escape. We could just use our Pokemon and, like, hmm. fight everyone off. Let's ask Luxray for help. Hmm. We can't, we can't just, I, I want to just put him in the vent. Let's put him in. Oh. There's a water cooler here. Oh, well, unit has water in Hoei. Even bad guys gotta wet their whistles, I suppose. They don't hang around for long. Someone is bound to stop by sooner or later. It's like, oh no, quickly! It's the casual meeting spot! Okay. Now I gotta run all the way back down the hall. It's just an electrode hanging out.
No one in this one. Oh, so wait, did someone collapse on the floor, is there? Oh no, Whooper! Oh man, we gotta do something! He's in trouble. But how can we get in there? Save him! It's time for the vent. That sounds promising. Yes. Okay, there's a vent down here. Let's go check it out. And the people are gonna be like, aha, here's the vent. Luxray, give me a helping hand. Oh no, but first of all, of course, I have to head back to Tim for help. Because Tim needs to be updated on the situation. Then I'm gonna have to walk back down the hall, put Pikachu in the vent. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey. Tim, there's a whooper that needs your help. It takes so long to tell you. And now I gotta walk back down the hall again. Hmm. Come on, Tim. Give me a boost. Sure thing. Hurry and go help. I got it covered. Please hurry. Use haste. Oh, are we gonna see the same animation that Pete plays every time Pikachu goes through a vent? Out in one piece. It's very dramatic when he goes through a vent. Hmm. Oh no, Wooper. He's injured. Now I need to unlock the door. Hey. Yeah, let's help him. Let's need water. We need to get some water ASAP. Which means I gotta walk back to the water cooler. <laughs> There, Wooper is saved. This was like they chose to do this. They could have made it so much more exciting. Okay. Riven in gameplay, we went to the water cooler and got Wooper a drink. <sighs> Wooper is a highlight of the game, though. Make no mistake. Give it any water, so it got weaker and weaker over time. Poor Whooper. So someone was putting its back after that, its mind went blank. But someone was a cube. Okay. But it doesn't have a cube on its back. It There's not even a cube there. Ugh. Like it, Tim, over here. it doesn't have Tim. one. Oopa. Oopa. Don't worry. I'm gonna solve this case soon so you can go back home. Don't worry, Wooper. Everyone dies. Hang in there. Oh. Photo of the Aurora drop. is all about maybe some valuable info on his desk hmm oh my god gameplay hang on let's invest oh we gotta enjoy this oh looks like a report about some experiments why isn't there a photo of the aurora drop attached to it the aurora drop fall from space and a couple of other section titles meteorites and extraterrestrial viruses and the aurora drop and meteoric energy it, it's just gonna be deoxys isn't it the Aurora dropping out of space. I have my head around what this research is even about. Hmm. Labeled business plan. Look at this page, these budget numbers are enormous. A lot of zeros, I wonder where this organization gets its funding. Hmm. 
Oh, the pin for the elevator is like two, two, four. Photo of Sableye. Same Sableye I met in the police station. We were roommates, actually. Some right on the back. Needs jewels, so watch out. Hmm. What do you What do you think, uh, Pikachu? This desk reminds me of all the times your mom would get annoyed with me. <laughs> She used to say, okay. it took a lot of talent to clutter up a room the way I did. Is that why you wanted a divorce, Pikachu? God, this place is a mess. It reminds me when your mom would yell at me, Tim. <laughs> like, what the fuck, Pikachu? It's deducing time. Why would you know want to steal the jewel? Beat Sableye. Further their research. Okay. Maybe there's a Deoxys in it. Uh, bro, thank you for 100 bits. I don't know if you noticed our TV Pikachu is voiced by, uh, why from Persona 5? Oh, like fucking Gunkle, is it? Gotta help me shoot someone. Hmm. It's good to know. The guy voice Chief Butler is actually pro ZD. Ah, uh, he did sound a bit familiar, yeah. Plus, I do feel bad, like, whenever we, like, we criticize voice acting and stuff like that, it is important to say, it's usually poor script and lack of direction. But I think that's probably, like, what a lot of, like, the cast is suffering from more than anything else. I think that's always an important distinction. Or, you know, a lack of financial resources, so why even try? <laughs> oh, God. Investigate the room where Wooper is. Oh, there's something else in there. Oh. Use the intercom to broadcast to other rooms in the facility. Hmm. Hmm. Let's use it. Oh! When fire or emergency alarm will sound throughout the entire facility. Okay, we got we gotta just set off the alarm. Hmm. How can we enter the other room? What could it be? Hmm. Can you find a way to the Mystic Mountain? No? Oh, the alarm won't go off. Sorry. What can I say? Four Pokemon's escape. Take the passcode by force. Pikachu's got a gun. Wait for the nightly maintenance checks. We just wait all day. Okay. Let's let's sit here for eight hours, Pikachu. Just use force. I want to. Believe me. Hey. Let's tell the gang to steer clear. Okay. We got them all to move. <laughs> okay. This is floor B1. A Pokemon has escaped the facility. I need you on the first floor right away. All of you. But, but we were told not to leave our post. <laughs> a very real response. Are you disobeying a direct order from your superior? But... 
Get yourselves up here now! Y yes, sir! Uh, Tim, Tim suddenly, like, Emergency. several octaves deeper. Emily's about, like, what are you thinking, Pikachu? It. They actually fell for it. Okay. Okay, let's go into the other room. Hey, Electrode. He's gonna blow! <laughs> Thanks, Electro, it's still here. Oh no. Electro about to use self destruct. A bomb's about to detonate. I'm gonna calm Electro down, but how? I think I know a way, Tim. Pokemon can't use self destruct, there's too much moisture in the air. <laughs> okay. Sure, I mean, that that's a plan. Really, then that means. We just need to dampen the air. Thanks, Rachel. Let's hurry, Tim. Don't think we have much time. Oh my god! <laughs> that sound effect was a bit louder than I thought it would be. Yeah, we just need to put Wooper in the room. This Wooper is damp. <laughs> Wooper has no fear. Yes. Yes. Okay. Electro, why'd you run up to explode all of a sudden? That started by some stranger showing up out of the blue. In order to attack us or anything. Only orders were to wait here. He's just gonna bring the entire building down. It explodes when stressed. Except that those unitized folks haven't been playing with it much recently. Hey! Okay, so Electro wasn't brought here by force. The pattern of a unitized member since before all this happened. Which says they're all really friendly. Pokemon like tools, it's hard to imagine them as anything other than bad guys. But they were just nice around Electro so it wouldn't explode. Mm -hmm. No one loves you, Electrode. Thanks, Wooper, for your dampness. Now we need a passcode. Oh. Dip out cubes. Oh. Look at these section heads. The Sanjeev Dennis's mansion. Pokemon inside the mansion. They leave their home up before stealing the Aurora drop. Mm. But did they? Did they really? Oh! They're using recorders. Dictating notes. We haven't even record witness statements. Actually, it does sound pretty helpful now that you mention it. Maybe that would be a fun game mechanic to have considered. Oh! Pass go to 720. 7020. Oh! 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 Mm -hmm. We're gonna have to go floor by floor, aren't we? Well, that's one down. Can't wait for the floor to look exactly mm -hmm. like the next one. And loading screens between them all. <laughs> it's just a wall! Why even give that a cutscene? Okay. Identical hallway. No, wait, no, it's a different layout. Hang on. Gonna need another passcode. <laughs> what 
they doing? Okay. Hmm. He's probably used for research. It's the meteorite, because Deoxys. Oh. Many meteorites landed throughout the sudden ruins in the past. It's a meatball. Uh, did they even give it a texture? Hmm. I don't think they did. Oh. Oh! Successfully hmm. completed mission at the ruins exceeds expectations. Performance review for the unit task member we saw at the ruins. It's, it's just a uh, it's just an uncolored blob. Yep. That's all that is. Um, hmm. Some really deteriorates and sent too. Hmm. No O this time. Really that hard. Important clue. If you have questions about anything you see here, just ask me. Thanks, Big Chip. Others is nothing to be embarrassed thanks, about. Thanks for this life teaching. Appreciate you, Pikachu. I know, I know you. Uh, I know he's got my back. Whoa! Have I not investigated everything yet? Oh, there was someone dropped a folder. Near its the sudden runes are not only exceedingly high, but also contain incredibly pure energy. Those are given an energy content of 87% or higher to be delivered to the lowest floor for use. Meteorites discovered in Mewtwo's cave are low in energy and cannot be used. Meteorite contains energy, I guess it's more than just a normal rock. Hmm. That's everything. Hey. It's deducing time. Hmm. Like, imagine a puzzle game. Well, it's 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 the detective game where the game assumes that you're stupid and like you can't figure it out, and then it's like, let's catch up. Oh god, they want to survey the ruins, the trade some coordinates, the materials to repair the facility, collect the energy. Okay. Nintendo nerf this game's potential. I want it like gritty crime thriller with Pikachu. You know, solving oh. actual mysteries and like elaborate webs. Pikachu catches a killer. Like, that's what I want. That looks like a dead end. We're gonna have to give Pangoro's help. Run on back. Hey. You have arms and legs, Tim. Climb. It's like, please. Probably gonna soft lock this. No, I don't, I don't think it's physically possible here. Let's go, Pangoro. What? Slap. Hmm. A 
That's a clear way through. Much obliged, Pangoro. We got a big room past here. Let's go get Tim and the others. Mm-hmm. Another map over here. Let's take a look. God forbid we get lost. There's Pascal. We found him in the standby room. Okay. Right. We're going to find the answers if I stand here. Let's head to the standby room. Mm hmm. <sighs> oh, it was a Pokemon. Oh. Dustmore. The cube must be forcing it to keep watch. I we saw it said something about controllers. We gotta help them. Gotta go without being spotted. This is a very big room. Is that store even gonna follow us the entire time? I just get him to like walk back this way. No, yeah, he's just gonna, he's just gonna keep going further in apparently. Go through here. <laughs> just got. I just gotta wait for him to to make the rounds. He's just like he's constantly just walking away from me with his back turned. Soundtrack guy is going ham. He despawned. Oh. Cube controller. The passcode's 2806. That, that's the same passcode I think they used Ooh. earlier. <laughs> I don't think they could even change the passcode. I think we had that earlier in the game. Oh, it was 2168. Sorry. Okay. Hey. I'm just assuming the worst at this point. <laughs> In fairness, the game hasn't given me much reason to hope. Other than divorce. I need to see how the divorce ends. Why did, like, Pikachu want to divorce his wife? Okay. Oh, now I also... Over here! Gotta run back. You okay? I'm glad you came to your senses. Since you're not attacking me, you must be back to normal, right? Riveting dialogue. Let's go for the stairs. Oh, it's just, it's just this room here. Oh! Oh! Her love input and numbers. Okay. Now we get the basement floor mm. three. My god! Another wall! Another map. Okay. Check the stairs. Whoa. I think we're better off not opening this door. Yeah. Huh? Pikachu. What is it? Where in the world is that cramorant? 
I swear it ran off this way. Why did he even swallow the controller in the first place? We can't stop that Excadrill without it. It'd be more efficient if we split up and searched. Good idea. I'll keep looking here while you check downstairs. Okay. I'll change the passcode to the stairs, just in case. How do It's gonna out be a too. pain in the neck, coming and going without card keys. Ah, stop complaining. Come on, Houndoom. <laughs> oh, okay. Mm -hmm. The Pokemon going berserk in that room is an Excadrill. Gotta help Excadrill as well. Save all the Pokemon. Where the map we saw should be another room up ahead. Can't wait to rapidly press A with the help of other Pokemon to defeat the Oxus. <laughs> Too dangerous there. Passcode's been changed. Oh, we do, Pikachu. Well, let's find Cramorant before Unitas doesn't get the controller. Okay. Cramorant's hiding, but Growlit's here. Nope. Growlithe Growl just got shut down. Oh no! It's on a rampage! Look at him go! God, he's tearing up the place! He's got like sauce on his hands. And there's no napkin. Oh, the humanity of it all! Oh my god, he's just gonna destroy us all! <laughs> he's not even doing anything. He's so small. How does Harry, how does Harry Am even fit in that room? <laughs> Speed. Oh, that's why. Unitas is after him. Hey. Chase that Cramorant. Follow his fetters. Instantly. Hey! Stop! Just let's try again. Look at him go. Cycle. That really has fire in as he's gonna go. Oh, okay, he's going further this time. Oh no! He's making a three point turn! Oh my god, you're kidding me. I was supposed to run that at the end. I gotta, I gotta just wait now. Taken shelter. <laughs> mm. 
more time to dance to the music, basically. The best part of the luxury sections. The music's just really good. Hey, Grammarat! It's the only good there, part. Yeah? The jig is up. Hey, wait! Calm down! 20 years in the slammer. That's right. I saw you gulp down the Aurora drop, remember? Yeah, that's because you were being controlled. So sure. anyway, tell me why you're being chased. It's all woe and woe and woe. What, what did you swallow? But, oh, oh. Oh, seriously? Look at that. The controller. My God. Don't you worry. I swear I'll get you out of this place. They actually animated him to throw up. Keep control. We can use the stop X control. Stick with us, Kramer, right? We're gonna keep you away. Okay, we're just gonna just gonna teleport back, is what the game meant to say. Job done. Oh, it's control sticky. Actually, I don't want to know. This pack here, right here is the switch, right? Go to the room where Excadrill is. It's causing a rampage. It sounded like he destroyed the room or something. Like, there was like crashing sounds, but everything is fine. Nothing bad has happened. And also, he's so small. <laughs> Hurry up, Tim! It's coming right at us! Oh no, he's walking Stop slowly! Stop. He's walking slowly towards us, Tim. Okay. Okay, he's fine now. Hey. Let's interview him. Excadrill, are good at digging holes, right? Write that down. half the size of a human teenager. He's so small. Hey. No, he just he just he just works here. Tried to drill out, but he couldn't. What have the humans here been like? More mistreatment of Pokemon, huh? There are more catchy Pokemon right here in these rooms. Gotta break them out. Mm -hmm. We need to investigate this room, find the card key. Mm -hmm. The table rooms on floor B3 were intended to hold the Pokemon sent to us by Mr. Butler. But due to unforeseen circumstances, the Pokemon will not be joining us. As a result, the table rooms on floor B3 are currently has Pokemon that were not part of our original plan. These are all the Pokemon that they got. And we're gonna send here. Holly Rat looks mean, yeah. Actually, hi, I'm a Corviknight. Corviknight? Oh, we haven't seen him in a while. This is the control utilized by Mr. Butler, are highly confidential. The interest to maintain this confidentiality, we destroyed the control remotely to ensure the police were only able to collect the broken remains. Any doubt of Unitas' involvement before this pretty much proves it. Let me see. The, oh, what's this under the cabinet? <sighs> Water leaking from floor B3. Mr. Murloc keeps his valuable research data on floor B4. Wait a minute. Mr. Murloc? He's involved? Oh, here's the key. Who could have foreseen this? 
business report. They don't even react to that, yeah. I see you, Mr. Howard Myers. Oh, sorry. I see you, Mr. Howard Myers is scheduled to arrive on the last day of Pokemon Friendship Week for a final inspection. Cubes are ready to be shipped pending the completion of the final inspection. And Myers is their CEO. He's the head on of his entire organization. Pop is the one running Unitas. Oh my god. It is so nonchalant. Like, that's supposed to be like a big reveal. And later, I guarantee you the game's gonna be like, Yes, it was I behind the crime. And you're still gonna have a big deal of it. It's like, Howard, no! Mayor Myers! How could you have done this? I mean, we already know. We, we already know. Oh. Anything over here? Location, the Galar region. Goal to advance the research and the development of the cubes. Details, gather as many different species of ice Pokemon as possible. The so unit has brought back down Manitan and the others. I can't believe they got dragged all the, all, here all the way from Galar. Well, this Pokemon meet at the ruins are doing okay. Finally, they got Gordon and Chris helping them out. Hey. This just further confirms that, yet yeah, confirms that this game just got stuck in development hell. Somehow. This took a long time to make. It's all about Gen 8. This game was just horrifically delayed. Sword and Shield came out 2019. You know, and that was actually the same year as the Detective Pikachu movie. I reckon they were trying to get this game out faster, but they just couldn't do it. And, like, for some reason, along the line, they were just like, fuck it, just release it anyway. Because I don't think they took extra time to work on the game. I think they were just like, fuck it. <laughs> Papa, why are you part of this? Oh, here's the dramatic reveal. Rachel's torn up emotionally. That's why she's got a big smile on her face now. I was shocked to find out her dear old dad is the head of Unitas. I was not sure what to say to her. Probably just needs some space to think, Tim. Or she'll recover from shock in her own time. I also forgot the whole how reveal, but one, something else is bothering me. Maybe we read earlier that mentioned Butler. Maybe we should focus on that. It's to do some time. Mm. I was Unitas capturing hmm. Pokemon. Distribute the cubes. Test subjects for the cubes. Am I going to Pokemon that uses test subjects for the cubes? It probably is that one. They just want to get cubes everywhere. They already have funding. Were they going to sell off the Pokemon? No, they're okay. just tested. I'll make sure the cubes are compatible with every kind of Pokemon. Sellotape cubes to them. Wait, what was that line? The developers must have been desperate to perfect the cubes. There's a lot we could say about the developers. Oh, Corviknight's just in here too. You're the one who stole Pikachu's hat. You're just here now. You can fly and none in the sky can scare you. It's pretty terrifying when you're flying at someone head on. Yes, it's kind of a sore subject, huh? Not even the devs knew what to do with this game. I don't think so. I think they just vomited this game out, because like, fuck it, we worked on it. Ah. Polyrath is hanging.
They said it in an interview, did they? Wait, no, what did they say in the interview? They actually talked about this game's development. Oh god, what what did they say? Why the sequel has taken so long. The main reason behind the delay is mostly the change in hardware and there were more specs available hardware-wise, there's a lot more things that were possible to do. It was hard to narrow down and figure out what exactly, what sort of things the developers wanted to do with this game. So, they just didn't figure it out and they were like, fuck it, let's release it anyway. They're just admitting they didn't know what to do, and they just vomited the game out. That's so bad. That's so awful. More specs available hardware-wise. Well, you didn't use any of those specs. <laughs> well, clearly they were confused. Oh, God, that's so bad. That's the laziest, like, answer from a dev I think I've ever seen. That's so awful. Oh, God. I'm so mad. Oh, here's Harry Armour. <laughs> they were developing for the GameCube when someone told him about the Switch. You think that's the change in hardware? <laughs> well, like, it was supposed to like, come out like 20 years ago, but... Uh, yeah, we just couldn't get it together in time. <laughs> te Let's test the strength by sumo wrestling. Okay. So lazy. Yeah, you know, thanks for the hundred business. Yeah, it gave us a huge disappointment. It really is. It's so sad. I can't believe the dev is just like, why did it take so long? It's like, ah, hardware. We just didn't know what we didn't know. No, it's not even just hardware. We didn't know what we were doing. <laughs> is the answer he gave. We didn't know what we were doing for the game. It shows. Like, you're telling me you need Nintendo Switch hardware to render, like, this fucking, like, gray room. Like, even the Pokemon models don't look as good as other games. Hmm. Need a way to get to the next floor. Um... Uh... Just ask him for the passcode, yeah. Just, just dig a hole. Okay. This game somehow is a 68 on Metacritic. How? How, how? how would it get that high? Maybe children are enjoying it. They're not. <laughs> mm -hmm. I can guarantee you they're not. God. That's terrible. I would give this game like a 2 out of 10. 2 or a 3 at most. Redeeming quality is just Pikachu himself. And like some of the Pokemon interactions, and that's it. Yeah. Like, yeah, th this looks like an early access title. This is just unfinished.
The most complicated this, this, get, thing this game has probably done is probably that shadow on the wall right now. That's probably it. It's a nice shadow. Kids deserve good games. Yep, they absolutely do. Minecraft is a kid's game. Mario is a kid's game. All mainline Pokemon games are kid's games. They deserve better. Zelda is technically a kid's game. The kids for everyone, you know? It's Minecraft a kid's game. It's for everyone, including kids. God almighty. Well, we're still going. I'm so mad. <laughs> Dan, how'd you get, manage to get into the early family and friends GameCube alpha for this game? <laughs> okay. Yeah, we made it down safely. The game was made on Unity, meaning that the jump meant nothing. They were bullshitting. Oh yeah, if it's a if it's on Unity, Unity's been around forever now. <laughs> That's not even a hardware issue, yeah. It's a Unity game, yeah. There's no excuse there. I didn't even think about that. They've been developing it since before 2005. Okay, we need a card key this time instead. Alright. Yeah, let's just, let's just keep going. None, none of the floors are particularly memorable. Let's just keep going. You gotta talk to your dad. Be honest with your feelings. I hope, I hope her dad just takes out a, like, a gun. <gasps> just take out a gun and start, oh, an open you fire. It again? Yeah. Like, Tim gets shot and, and has to merge with a Pokemon or something. Just do it. But, Pikachu's consciousness feels like it's getting weaker. Okay, Pikachu, Pikachu's in trouble. We can't let him disappear, though. What is it now? I'm stuck on your foot. Looks like some orders addressed to the operations team. Proceed immediately to Jessica Miller's location. <laughs> Why is that on your foot? Find her at the pizzeria in Bamboo Burrow. Capture the sleeping man discovered in Mewtwo's cave. Oh, what's that on my foot? Oh, look, I stepped in some exposition. Oh, God. <laughs> Pikachu literally stepped into the plot. He just stepped on it. That's so lazy. Hey, Growl, let's worry about crime around. Investigate the floor. Okay. What's going on? Is he working with Mayor Myers that work is resume at the Pokemon Unity Lab? They do Emma's research on mutual understanding between humans and Pokemon. Well, through speech and the direct sharing of consciousness. To successfully achieve, Rhyme City will become an even safer place and more pleasant place to live. The organization takes its name from Emma's final project, Unitas. I'd like to join Unitas myself. Research will benefit countless people. As a research, I expect this to be very fulfilling work. I'm proud to be part of the organization. Look at the title Investigation Report of the Sleeping Man Found in Mewtwo's Cave. Report about my body. After bringing the Sleeping Man back to the lab, we applied electric shocks out of external stimuli in an attempt to wake him, but to no avail. It's a condition we believe the subject was asleep for quite some time. An electrocardiogram and various blood tests all returned results within the expected range for an adult human male. 
The only anomaly we observe in the subject is his brain waves, which occasionally exhibit irregular behavior. But these regularities are not significant enough to warrant any great concern. They do not seem to be negatively affecting his body. Though the sleep man has not been consumed any food under while under our observation, his muscle mass shows no signs of atrophy. The working hypothesis that the energy within his body is maintained in his current condition. Dad's just sleeping, he's still totally healthy. Gotta be thanks to you two. Honestly, I'm just happy to hear I'm still alive. Yeah, we got it. We gotta save Dad. Location: Bamboo Burrow. Target: Jessica Miller. Objective: Retrieve, retrieve the thumb drive. Oh, what happened in Bamboo Burrow? Prepare that the thumb drive is secured. This is a direct order from her CTO. And what is it? Why'd you stop reading? Is it you know how CTO is? Mr. Murloc. Oh shit! No way! Actual surprise Pikachu face. Okay, CEO and Murloc's the CTO. Papa Murloc leads the organization together! <laughs> we already knew this! Map of Abu Burr attached this document. D do you really need a map? It's a straight line! <laughs> It's a straight fucking line! <laughs> like, mm. uh, the reason why Unitas attacked Jessica in Babu Burrow. But, she, but no, she had- we already said it! She had the fucking flash drive! Just said the reason. Oh my god, game. Mm -hmm. We literally just said what it was. Mm. Card keys. No, from the CTO. Gold cubes currently op currently in operation are effective on nearly all Pokemon. Not completely effective on rock type Pokemon. The must be updated to address this flaw. It would be a simple task were I to handle it myself, I have other more pressing work to attend to. Alright, as we find the effectiveness of the control cubes at all costs, you need to increase the strain on the cubes, the cubes inflict upon Pokemon's bodies. This guy in Bamboo Burrow is controlling the rock type Pokemon, no problem though. He must have upgraded the cubes. Anything else? Research team to the management team orders from the CTO. And the data from Jessica Miller, a resident of Bamboo Borough. You can notify the operations team to carry out these orders immediately. Do we find any more information? Mm -hmm. It's a note with orders to target Jessica. What could it mean? Why? Why did they go after Jessica? Gee, fucking golly. Wait, isn't this... Hmm. Much gears here, there's also an open space in the middle. Does, does the door run on fucking clockwork? Is it a clock? <laughs> Why is it gears? Why is it gear suddenly? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Voice recorder on the desk. But there was a cord on it too. Let's hear it. I want to try the voice recorder they gave me. It's supposed to be for keeping research notes. You really think recording casual conversation like this is okay? Well, it's not like anyone else is going to listen to this. By the way, remember when Mr. Myers stopped by recently? Haven't seen him around for a while. I think he had a meet with Mr. Murloc. I'd love to know what they were discussing. Oh yeah, well lucky for you, I sat in on that meeting to keep minutes. Thank God I'm recording all of this for some fucking reason. Mr. Murloc made the cubes, you know. So the mayor is putting his complete trust in him now. Isn't that good? Guess what, I don't know. It's the way Mr. Myers said it. He was like, we need the cubes so a disaster like the Aronson can never happen again. Seriously, worked up, practically shouting, in fact. 
I guess it's understandable, considering he lost his wife Emma in the hour incident. Yeah, I never met her, but I heard she was a truly gifted researcher. Same, plus the mayor's got a daughter. He's just trying to keep her safe and make sure what happened to Emma doesn't happen to her too. He literally said I would do anything to protect my daughter. Family man, huh? Respect. Sure, but even so, the intense look on his face, he should have seen it. I mean, I was legitimately terrified of him. What's like the worst possible way we can reveal this villain's motives? Yeah, a random voice recorder documenting the conversation from two nameless NPCs. I'm glad that's how they reveal motivations. Also, for the game that actually is touted for having actual voice acting, they did not use voice acting for the voice recorded bit. Someone's building a computer. Clink. Wonder how we're gonna solve the, uh, the. Oh my god, let me get the gears. What was that? That's not an NVIDIA 2080 RTX. Bye. Some kind of Pokemon inside the computer. Can't see inside, is it okay? Clink. It's found the perfect little cap to wedge itself into and take a nap. He's just hanging out in there. Need to find his partner. Which has been napping while waits for its partner to return. Clink. Why don't you go look for him then? Clink. Just smash the computer. Just pick it up and smash it, Tim. No, we need to go back, obviously, and grab the tools. Which are on this desk. Why don't they give us photos for other things they're talking about? Why is this the only... They could do this more. Well. Let's help them. It's so much talking. Blowtorch! Just get him out. Get him out. Hit him with a hammer. Sticking the screwdriver in through the gap. You mean? I guess it could work. I'll give it a try. No luck, it's really stuck in there. Oil. Let's just, yeah, let's just pour oil on the computer. He's just out. Quack, quack, quack. There was a Clink inside. Now we gotta interrogate Clink. Blank, blank. What you doing in the computer? Hey. Get along with the humans? Good friends with your partner. His partner hasn't seemed so happy since you two came here. Maybe because his partner seems really concerned about something. Maybe Clink's partner is having second thoughts about the development of the cubes. Card key. Partner has a tool. And we put Clink in the, like, gear shaft? <laughs> Let's go get Clink. In you go, bud. Okay, Clink, do your thing. Clink, Clink. He's having the time of his life. Yeah. It works. Let me go find your partner. You know where your partner is, Fred. I can't help you with that one. Okay, there he goes. See you, Clink. You just ascends. Hope Clink finds his partner. Figure out what Murloc was investigating. I actually hate this game. I just glanced at chat. <laughs> I was going to ask how y'all holding up. That's the first thing I see. Mm -hmm. oh, it's so bad. Mm -hmm. 
Need a more effective method of extracting energy from the meteorites. A tremendous amount of high purity energy is required to activate the Aurora Drop. This is my recent experiments were able to lay out a plan to achieve the final goal. Meteorites. Mm hmm. The experiment in which I exposed the Aurora Drop to energy from the meteorites was a success. The Aurora Drop showed clear signs of activation. But only a fragment of the hole was activated. The string is activation throughout the entirety of the Aurora Drop. Hmm. I wonder if the Aurora Drop is a Pokemon. <laughs> Those photos of Dad and, P Dad and Pikachu. Why oh is there a picture of you in there, Pikachu? We already fucking I'm know. It doesn't belong to an adoring fan. We already know, Tim. We We've already this. established this. How could he be so dense? Mm -hmm. Did you trade your brain for that iconic red hoodie? Well... Mm -hmm. <sighs> Jesus, Tim. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something about the cubes. Example, Detective Pikachu. Pretty famous in Rhyme City. He's got I destroyed that Slowpoke statue. Come to see, you probably start feeling less safe. So they just framed Pikachu. We are we already knew this. No concerns with using Butler. Anything goes wrong with the PvP, the responsibility will fall entirely on him. Butler was working with Murloc as well. Project Detective Pikachu Phase 1. Meet the specimen in person and measure its vitals. Project Detective Pikachu Phase 2. See the specimen from the PPB. Project Detective Pikachu Phase 3. Extract the energy from the specimen. Okay. Well, he got Pikachu's mm -hmm. fur away earlier, so... He got something. He's gonna be able to extract energy. Okay. What on earth is he planning? To no, I'm not curious about anything. Mm -hmm. There's another voice recorder. Report subject. Okay, it's working. Voice acting. Oh my god. I Howard that I would like to resume Emma's final research project. It focused on coexistence with Pokemon, the Unitas project. I also pointed out that conducting such research would require a proper facility. Naturally, I suggested we name this new facility the Unitas Lab. <laughs> Howard was rather taken with that name. He accepted my proposal immediately. <laughs> and with that, all obstacles to my research have been removed. It does sound like AI. Hey. Let's listen to the Q presentation. <laughs> Why Report is subject pause? Cube presentation. I gave my presentation about the cubes to Howard today. He seemed concerned about the strain they may put on Pokemon. But in the end, he understood that some side effects here and there are simply unavoidable. Now we can continue development without looking over our shoulders. Once production is going smoothly, I plan to move on to the project I've kept on the back burner until now. Aww. I think there's one more audio recording on here, too. The Fitness Gram Pacer Test is a multi-stage aerobic capacity test that progressively gets more difficult as it continues. The 20-meter Pacer Test will begin in 30 seconds. Line up at the start. The running speed starts slowly, but gets faster each minute after you hear this signal. A s <laughs> oh, God. Play the whole tape, it'll be less boring than this shite. I can just keep it running. Single lap should be completed each yeah, time you hear hey. this sound. Remember to run in a straight line and run as long as possible. 
The second time you fail to complete a lap before the sound, your test is over. The test will begin on the word start. On your mark, get ready, start. One. Hey, God, wait, what was the number again? Oh, that's absolutely copyrighted music. Okay, let's stop there. <laughs> uh, you won't be seeing that on YouTube. <laughs> We didn't have funky music with our, like, beep test. It's basically the same thing. Hmm. Hmm. Where should we start looking? Hmm? Shutting down the fusing machine. Shut down the machine in the event of an emergency. Remove the power cable. <laughs> That's it. All says from the messy writing of a job that Sam must have been in a hurry. Okay. Go mm. exist plan for Rhyme City. This says confidential. Looks like it contains a schedule for distributing distributing the cubes throughout the city. Says the mayor will make an announcement about the cubes on the last day of Pokemon Friendship Week. This speech in here too, I'll read it. This is Rhyme City. Allow me to once again express my plans for our mutual home and to foster a city in which people and Pokemon can live together in peace and safety. Many of you, the Iron incident of two years ago was an unprecedented hardship. I assure you no one knows that hardship better than I do. Rhyme City will not stop moving forward. A testament to our commitment to mutual coexistence between people and Pokemon, we've created a truly revolutionary device. Behold the Friendship Cube. Gonna have to stop him. Oh, look. Look, looks like the mayor was taking some drugs too as he was like undergoing his research. He's got like a syringe here for some reason. <sighs> there was a failure to make two become one. The proper balance of energy is absolutely critical. Too much or too little result in failure. The adjustments will be difficult but necessary. You can do this. I know I can do this. Only I can make two become one. Okay. It was like completely covered in sloppy, sloppily scribbled equations. They look complicated. All means nothing to me. Hmm? There's a voice recorder. Hmm. This voice recorder also belongs to Murloc. Hey. Hmm. Let's listen to it. Research data. What's with the pause? <laughs> Report subject. Research data. Every time. six months prior to the R incident, I discovered a method of linking the minds of humans and Pokemon. This would make it possible to control Pokemon as we please. I'm certain this is the greatest discovery of the century. But it was not possible at that stage of my research to make my hypothesis a reality. More information was required. Since then, I've searched relentlessly for the missing piece of the puzzle. God, it's Until so last, boring. <laughs> I found it in the research that Emma had previously conducted. It's so boring. She called my research dangerous. The music insisted makes that I it stop, more boring. But that was well. no concern of mine. I took the, the first opportunity to did, scour did, the did, research did. facility, but by that point, Emma's data was nowhere to be found. Jessica did this. I will stop at nothing to find Jessica and retrieve the data she took. God, it's so dull. What? 
Hey, Jessica Tiger, that Evan's data stolen. Also, we can work on his new research. That's so awful. Let's find Jessica. Pause. Report subject. Finding Jessica. I had not expected Pikachu and his allies to show up in Bamboo Boro. Nevertheless, we did manage to find Jessica and retrieve the research data. Now that the last piece of the puzzle is in my possession, my research is finally complete. With this data, I can conduct simulations of linking minds. I'm falling asleep. Hey. There's one more, proving my hypothesis. I gotta put on some more exciting music. Report subject. Proving my hypothesis. I did it. I finally did it! To become one! That is the answer! To become one! This is definitive proof that my hypothesis was correct! Oh shit! I wish I could have shown this to Emma and Jessica. Cubes are nothing more than toys now. <laughs> He's using my mom's research for his own ends. What is wrong with that man? <laughs> that, was, that was much more entertaining. Relax trying to make something even worse than the cubes. Gotta stop him. What if Murloc's evil? Uh, in case you wonder where that music from, that's from Pokemon Type and Adventure, and that is the boss battle. Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> okay, let's start deducing. It's deducing time. Hmm. I need that the the research data that Jet. Yeah, we've known this the whole fucking time. We even okay. said it aloud earlier. God, I forgot I was mad about that. It took so long to get back to it. Hmm. <laughs> like, you even said it earlier. I see. Burlock's kicked me out. Okay. Figured it out, and my consciousness is in Pikachu's body. Oh, why is he been telling me so persistently? Meteorite, Aurora drop, human. What do the numbers mean? Just right in, he's wrote, he did not try to even hide the pin numbers. He has no more, he's willing to do whatever it takes to pursue his research. We gotta do something. Hey. Got a moment? What is it? I think we should organize our findings so far. Yeah, let's lay it out. Do we need hmm. to do that? As much as clear, uh, three people are at the center of this mystery. How would Murloc and Emma? So we're closely connected with Unitas. They each have different goals. Think a, more, a bit more about those three people. Hmm. I was trying to have cubes attached to Pokemon of Rhyme City. In that Bacorn, I least kind of understand where he's coming from. Let's protect it. Rachel and make sure something like the Iron Suit never happens again. Got good intentions, but his meds are way off the mark. Hmm. Murloc is set and continue his research no matter what. He went so far as stealing Emma's research so he could advance his own. Don't know exactly what he's researching, but I think it's safe to assume it's nothing good. That's about si simulations of Lincoln Mines. Hmm. What are Emma's ideals? Trying to create a society where humans and Pokemon can perfectly coexist. I thought she had a good heart. I hope she's evil. I hope she is like the most fucked up of them all. Like, like Murloc had to actually shoot her in the head to stop her before she got went too far. She was literally like, like in like a steamroller and about to drive over the orphanage. 
Like, she, this woman was unhinged. Please. Hmm. Give us something, game. Let's leave. Hmm? Here's someone talking up above. Why is there a hole here? Dramatic piano chord. <laughs> oh no! Hey, sweet! <laughs> really? They dropped their card key! Was he like fucking okay. passing it between his hands? Was he spinning it? How? <laughs> Oh, this game sucks. <laughs> it's so bad. Okay. Huh? huh? What do you think you're doing here? Whoa! Run for it! Oh no! Hey, wait! Let's go, gamers. Pikachu's not gonna make it. Hey, why'd you stop? <laughs> Goodbye. What'd you say? <laughs> He's just gonna set the place on fire. Hey, Growlit, what are you doing? <laughs> Holy what? shit! He's gonna kill us Pikachu. all. Pikachu, Growlit's buying us some time. You you could bolt run. I'll come back for you. I swear. <laughs> you could bolt just run. This is bad. Uh. Well, it's time to punch through the crates. You're dead. You're dead. Really? You're dead. Perfect. Why are they even here? <laughs> Gotta be a way to open this door. Luxray is gonna trip the switch. <laughs> oh no, they're coming. We're gonna lose another Pokemon. <laughs> Slowly go. W weren't the other team like running down the hall? Come on, let's go. How long was that hall? <laughs> oh, the floor's so shoot. slippy. I can't believe Luxray is dead. Yeah. Oh no, there's more boxes in this hall. <laughs> how, how did the grunts even get through here? Why are these here? Perfect. Awesome, we're getting the help out so much. Okay, we gotta take the elevator. We must stay behind too, for some reason. Oh no, you're not planning to stay behind too. Um, uh... There's not even a threat this time. <laughs> There's no one you, even there. Wait, you can't. The doors closed the other end. 
Oh, they caught up. Okay. I guess Luxray's dead. You guys. Why'd they all die? We could have just, we could have just used the elevator. Pikachu. They could have just got in. We closed the doors. We could have all left. We finally made it. Yeah. And that means it's possible Mayor Myers is just ahead. Hey, don't worry about me. Four of our friends are dead. Murloc may have fooled my father, but we're about to prove what a crook he really is. That's right. Hey, hey! What about my body? Oh, don't you worry. We haven't forgotten. Oh, well. Okay, then. Sure. <laughs> The lab bills, and my god. Hey, look! It's dead! Sure, we finally of course found he's me. here. Well. Finally made it to the bottom floor. So everyone back upstairs is still okay. Here's someone up ahead. Who could it be? Someone's humming. It's Murloc. Yeah, that probably means Howard's here too. You know what to do, Tim. We convince the mayor to stop this plan they're working on. How are we gonna stop him? By just like convince them. Look at my evidence. Yeah, for everyone. All right, let's do this. It's deducing time. Tell he's evil because Excellent. he has a beard. Excellent. <laughs> Mr. Murloc. Oh, why would you look at this? What might you all be doing here? Yes, it must have been the cause of all that commotion earlier. That's why my entire staff rushed upstairs. The question of why you're still here, you're here still stands. I would invite you to join him for front row seats to the ship and of the cubes. Let ourselves in, actually, we're here to see the mayor. Tell us, Mr. Murloc, where is. Wait, here he comes. Rachel. Papa. Looks like the whole cast is here. We need to prove Murloc's deception and put a stop to his scheme. Yeah, but where do we even start? It's deducing time. Tim Goodman, what are you doing here? I've been investigating a mysterious group. They're called Unitas. But he's literally the CEO, Tim. <laughs> he, he knows this. Investigating Unitas? Why are you doing that? Unitas has been causing some serious problems, Mayor Myers. How does he not know? Problems? What are you talking about? Papa, please listen. Are they Mayor actually Myers, making it out so he doesn't Unitas know? Unitas is a dangerous organization. But all they do is conduct research into Pokemon. Oh my god, he's that dense. I created Unitas for the benefit of Rhyme City. How could that be dangerous? On what basis do you make this claim? Oh my god. Uh, they, I mean, they did a lot here. Um, they stole a jewel. They made Pokemon go berserk. I did. did w I mean, everything is relevant here. No. Nah, no, Unitas didn't do that. Well, they did. Come on, think back. <laughs> they did though.
They no. also caused that? No! They Come were on, literally there! They were literally there! Remember the jewel theft at the Dennis it's residence? It's just the jewel theft. Yes, I did hear that the Aurora drop was stolen the day We've after the award that they destroyed the forest. That's right. And Unitas was involved in that incident. Excuse me? And I also have evidence that the Aurora drop was brought here. How could that be? How could it be? I'm sure that was just a few bad apples. Oh my fucking lord. You can't say the whole organization is dangerous <sighs> just because of that. Actually, they've committed other crimes as well. And they even targeted us, too. This is so stupid. How does he not know he's literally the CEO? What other crimes you guys commit? Yep, they did that. They trapped us in ruins. I was allowed to get close out. They attacked us in the ruins and bamboo burrow. Everywhere we went, we kept getting attacked by Unitas. I'm sure that was just a misunderstanding. <laughs> Misunderstanding? They even went after me and Jessica! It's like, it's like, Mr. Rachel, Mayor, there is a man too? in a coma behind you! What do you think the research is about? Look, did you know about this? There's a comatose man in a tank behind you! Yeesh, he's completely ignoring us. <laughs> Please, Papa! Oh, surely it's a misunderstanding! This. I can't do that. Not when human Pokemon coexistence is so close to being achieved. And the cubes are how you'll achieve that? Exactly. Who likes bits? Pokemon can be dangerous at times, but the friendship cubes will solve that problem. Oh my... Good lord. Cubes? Mayor Myers, those cubes are the problem. Do you have any idea how Pokemon have been harmed because of those cubes? Pause. <laughs> what harm did the cubes cause? Yep. Yep. Not so much that one. Yeah, he just, he just attacked people here and the... Yeah, he anyway, literally did! Isn't that a bit off? Think about when the cubes were used to do bad stuff. Oh, I'm sorry. I guess when th the cubes were used to attack the fucking city. It's not that bad, Pikachu. The PPB incident. The case with Butler. I did hear about that. He was using one of those cubes to make a Pokemon commit crimes. You what? Why would he misuse the cubes that way? He's because literally that, just working behind you as well. My wrongfully arrested. I nearly lost a member of my family because of those cubes. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> You've helped me understand how the friendship cubes could be dangerous. <laughs> my if God. they're misused. Which is not enough oh for a reason to stop this operation. God, it's so painful! Papa! With the friendship cubes, humans and Pokemon can finally understand one another. Mayor Myers, can't you see you're being deceived? Hmm? What do you mean? <laughs> this man's replaced his brain with a Fisher Price toy. Try Pokemon of the free will so humans can force them to do whatever they want. The purpose of the cubes, in truth. These are the worst cutscenes I've ever Pokemon seen of their as well. Free will this is so force them to do laughably what humans bad. Want. I was told it's just the like pan and shots. It's so lazy. It's so lazy. And Pokemon to live in harmony. Mayor Myers, you've been deceived this whole time by the name Friendship Cube. They're actually called... Control cubes. Please, you have to stop this before it's too late. 
It's so no, bad. No, never. <laughs> Even if it's all true, this was Emma's dream. You know this wasn't Mama's dream. Rachel. Papa, don't you remember? When I was little and got lost in Bamboo Burrow, an Ursa ring saved me. I was afraid and crying, and since it was worried for my safety, the Ursa Ring chose to rescue me. All Pokémon have free will and can think for themselves. But you're trying to impose your will onto theirs. Do you really believe that's right? How can you claim to coexist with Pokémon if you take away their free will? Papa, is that really the future you want for Rhyme City? My god, it's because so emotional. Mama's dream for people and Pokemon was nothing like this. And if she knew, if Mama saw this, you just can't do this, Papa! Rachel, I didn't realize what the friendship cubes were really doing. <laughs> My I god. That I was wrong. He's so stupid. I'm sorry, Rachel. What a touching moment. I nearly made a terrible mistake that couldn't have been undone. As much as I'd like to, we can't wrap this up just yet. You're There's such one a moron. To take care of. Yes, who took advantage of my plan? Oh, there was Who a glitch there. The subtitles didn't come up fast enough. There's only one person it could have been. Who could it have been? It's time to expose the one pulling the strings. To Who could it possibly yeah. be? <laughs> if only there was like a scientist like working. <laughs> Fucking, it's Mewtwo. It's gotta be Mewtwo. <laughs> come on, that's not it. Only one person could give orders on Howard's behalf. My god, it's Jessica Miller! <laughs> Come on, that's not it. Only one person could give orders on Howard's behalf. No, of course, it's Will Butler! <laughs> Come on, that's not it. Only one person could give orders on Howard's behalf. Oh my god, it's Howard. It's right, it's more personal. Howard, it's your dead wife! She's been communicating and orchestrating this plan from beyond the grave! It was Charles Murlock. The one behind this? Mr. Murloc! You're the culprit! Uh, will you shut up? Uh, that, that, that summarizes how I feel playing this game. <laughs> he gets us. I have to say, I'm incredibly disappointed in you, Mayor Myers. You know you're playing right into Pokemon's hands, don't you? Rhyme City's a lost cause if you can't even protect your only daughter. What did you say? Go. Murloc! You were deceiving me? <laughs> your role in this is <laughs> come to an end. <laughs> and he's still not real. <laughs> As for the great detective duo, the only I knew you were good, now. but even I'm impressed you made it all the way here. <laughs> Mr. Murloc, those cubes will never be used again. Give up already. <laughs> you are deceiving me! <laughs> you really think I care about that plan? It was nothing more than a means to an end. Behold! This is the masterpiece that I've truly been created. Uh, Harry's just hanging out there, too. You mean, this has nothing to do with the cubes? We saw the meteorite and the aurora drop in the lab. Do those have something to do with my dad and Pikachu? Excuse me? You dared to snoop through my research? 
But like you left your, your pin on the whiteboard. You left all your Explaining notes out. It would be pointless. Just pay attention. Pay attention. I've got a bad feeling about this. How oh, our Pokemon friends have just calmly gotten the lift down to see us. Okay. You guys, you're all right. Oh no, the cubes. Here they are. Huh? Pikachu. Huh? <laughs> what do you think you're doing? But why, Pangoro? Finish the job, Pangoro. Tim, look. Of course, they're all being controlled. <laughs> In he goes. Murloc, let me out! Hey! Okay, it seems I've got everything I need. It's time to get the show started! I hope Tim just dies. <laughs> I I want to see Tim get, like, mauled by a Luxray. And, like, punched, like, have his spine snapped. Or, like, Pangoro on that. I just want to see him die. <laughs> I hate him. I have to realize my dream, my dream of becoming a Pokemon. I want to become a Pokemon? Yes, yes I do. Dude, I needed this. Time for a dramatic piano chord? I can't chord? believe you may recognize this. The Aurora Drop? What are you, what are you gonna do with that? Easy. <laughs> Let me just log on the sign on the windows here. <laughs> now Is this cutscene really necessary? At long last. Oh my god, what could he be doing? Oh my god! Oh, it worked! A Pokemon? Wait, hold on a minute. What Professor Gordon said about the Pokemon from space? <laughs> <laughs> what? It's not even dramatic. <laughs> Deoxys has returned! <laughs> A little bit now. This can't be happening. And to think I was complicit oh, in Oh, shut the plan. fuck up! <laughs> oh, the best is yet to come. <laughs> you fucking brain <laughs> dead moron! <laughs> Pikachu! Murloc, let him go! Oh, I've come too far to stop now. The sleeping man and Detective Pikachu both brought me the energy I need. <laughs> Pikachu's in pain. These energies come together as one. All of my research, all of my dreams, will finally become reality! <laughs> Silence. Let me just quietly sit in the chair. Why is no one trying to stop? Okay. What is he doing? Oh my god. Hi there, Tim. What? Don't tell me 
Murloc just... Yes! This is the answer! How can a person become a Pokémon? How horrifying. The best way for humans to understand Pokémon is for them to become Pokémon themselves. Okay. A union of human and Pokémon. This is the true meaning of coexistence! Uh, I'm so sad. Oops. <laughs> he really just stepped on it. Whoopsie doodle. your friend Pikachu? What? What? Well, what are you waiting for? Punch the shit out of him. Just, just do something. Give us some payoff for playing this god awful game. As you can see, weaklings like you aren't even worth my time. <laughs> gonna leave him there. Incredible! I can feel the power welling up within me! So this is what it's like to be a Pokemon! <laughs> okay, now what? I think it's time for me to enjoy the outside world. Wait! I'll be seeing Oh, now Tim makes a run for it. What are we going to do? What now? We've got to do something. But first I need to help Pikachu. <clears throat> What's that? Oh. oh, I guess he's just dead. What's happening? It's gonna be Mewtwo and they're gonna fight. Wow. Mewtwo! Why does the music just cut out all the time? I cannot imagine why, but I sense a human's presence within that Pokemon. Like, it's silent. Tell me what has happened? That guy used the energy in Dad and Pikachu to become Deoxys. Is that so? Not only has he misused my energy, he is using a Pokemon for his. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look at him go. That is actually getting kind of exciting suddenly. Oh God, action! You look evenly matched. We have to do something. The slab's gonna collapse before either one of them wins. We need to get somewhere safe. Just, just rip the helmet off Murloc. That's it. Rachel, Mr. Myers, take shelter in the elevator. But, Tim. I'll save Pikachu. Okay, Growlithe and the others might be hurt. I'll take care of them. Come on, Papa, let's go. Right. Tim, you be careful. Just, just get out of here, Mr. Mayor. You're the worst. I hope the facility collapses on him. Ground the others we save it, Rachel. I gotta focus on saving Pikachu. 
It's sleeping. Oh, wait. Remember how you shut it down? Just pull the power. Hang on. I just t yanked the cord. <laughs> just inside the pod. I can't get it open. Here, you don't have to shout. I'm glad you're okay. Or less this thing will open up. You get me out of here. Open from this side either. Must be locked. Must be a Pasco terminal around here by chance, do you? I saw two numbers written now in Murloc's lab. Why'd he write this on the whiteboard? Pikachu! Wow, that was intense. But looks like both me and Pikachu are okay. What a relief. I gotta say, looks like the party's in full swing. Believe Look it or at them not, go. it's Murloc. Yeah, I know. Looks like he's become a Pokemon. We have to stop him somehow. I can't imagine you two losing. But we humans caused this mess. We're the ones who've got to clean it up. Yeah. Well said, Pikachu. What about your body? I look safe enough in there. Anyway, let's hurry. You okay? Yeah. He's not long for the world. Oh, Pikachu might die. This I hope bad. so. <laughs> Am I gonna get my dream come true? <laughs> oh, we gotta do is stop Murloc. But ow! I guess it goes minus. All I know is we gotta do whatever we can. Great detective tip number 48. Never ever give up. Uh, you skipped a few tips there, Tim. Stop the energy Murloc extract from being supplied to the machine. We might be able to reverse the fusion. Just, just pull the power cord. I just yanked the cable. Investigate. Hmm. Actually, see one thing well, I don't know anything about a special piece of equipment like this. Fill around with it and see what works. Press random buttons. <laughs> I push a button, Tim, try to deduce how to cut off the power to the machine. No good. Probably a specific order you gotta do. Oh my god, a puzzle! Whoa! Holy shit! An actual puzzle. this in the right order before you pull the lever? Um, is it just one, two? Push this one first. There we go. My god. Press them all. It's the wrong one. Is he colorblind? No good. I just want to enjoy the moment that is an actual puzzle here.
Oh my god, it goes here. Then it goes to here. And then it goes to here. No way. It's one, two, three, four, but which way are you count one, two, three, four? Now hang on. This is beyond me. Of course, one, two, three. Pull the lever. <laughs> well, that was a, that was a real brain scratcher, gang. All right, the switches are off. We gotta fill with the fusion machine itself. Why are they only introducing actual puzzles now? Why wasn't this throughout the game? Carl, there's the only option here. Pull the plug. <laughs> Machine's still running. Tell me what they're doing is try poking around some more. The lock's been released. Is that everything? Like this. Yes. Amazing. Okay. It didn't work. Nothing's changing. The excess energy didn't do anything because they're already fused together. Thank you, Tim. There has to be another way. A gun? Wait a minute. Murloc wrote about the energy in that report of his we uncovered. What are you thinking, Pikachu? That's right. What exactly did Murloc use that energy for again? Uh, so sleep like Harry. Use the energy to wake up Deoxys, who lay dormant when the Aurora drop. Use the energy that was in Harry and Pikachu's body to fuse himself with Deoxys. To run the gigantic machine. He wanted to take a nap. No, that's not right. There must be another way to use the energy. Fuse himself with Deoxys. That's it! If Murloc used that energy to fuse himself with Deoxys, then maybe that's the key to separating them! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What are you going on about? Murloc and Deoxys are fused together because of that energy. According to the report, the balance of that energy is crucial. Oh! So we just gotta disrupt that balance! Yeah, but. How do we do that? Gun? Close the oxygen to more energy by destroying the machine by removing energy from Murloc's body. We're using a cube to control the oxygen. Just toss a cube at it. No, that won't work. They're fused together, like me and Pikachu. Throw a fucking cube. An outside force. Something like that ought to throw him off balance. More energy. If we can somehow expose Deoxys to these two energies... That excess energy will throw off the balance. But how do we do that? Once we figure that out, we can get back at him for throwing me into that pod. 
What are we gonna do? Deoxys flying around. The busted fusion machine. And then there's me, the great detective Pikachu. What are you thinking, Pikachu? It's the same Aha. voice line every time. I think I've got it! A bolt of brilliance! I'll jump up from the top of this machine and hit Deoxys with the energy! Oh, how very thoughtful. Sure. Time to close this case! Please. Please, God, end it. If we take the elevator, I should be able to get over there. Okay, hand him over, Tim. I can't wait to pr press A yeah. rapidly. There. Mm. Here's the special alcohol. Looks piece. like we're ready Pikachu. to go. So one last finish. shot of tequila for the road. <laughs> Ooh, thank you for a thousand bits earlier. Thank you for everyone giving bits. So Van Grogeris, my boyfriend had to leave early for bed. This game is causing him too much pain. <laughs> You're sure you can do this? You mean oh, we get the oxygen in midair with two capsules of energy? You can't do that. Only I can do this. Yeah, I know. It's just, isn't there another way? Come on. Who do you think I am, Tim? In all my cases, I've never given up. I'm the great detective, Harry Goodman. We've gathered all the evidence. You got a Pikachu. Now all we gotta do is use it to pin down the culprit. Tim is not convinced. Oh, everyone else is just on the elevator still. <laughs> Please be careful. Just leave this to me. Rachel's just working away. <laughs> Oh, they're charging. Wait, wait, what are they doing? If they unleash those moves, this place will explode! I've gotta hurry! I've gotta hurry! Look at the stubby little legs. He's out of breath. It deoxys with the energy. Okay, let's get this done. Just need our body to hold out for me. <laughs> oh, you gotta press this a lot. <laughs> And he goes. Oh, it's such a insignificant. Oh, he's just dead now. We did it. Pikachu. Uh, is, is like Harry's body just gonna die? <laughs> used up all my strength. That's body still down there. I can't make it. You need to go on without me. But Dad. Uh, 
Get them to safety. Don't wait up for me. He's gonna die. Hang in there. Yes. We're almost out of here. Oh, finally, something good happened. Press it, Tim. Oh, don't hesitate. I can see why IGN gave it a 6 out of 10 now. Take care of Irene and Sophia. They need you. But I don't need Irene myself, you know, because I wanted to divorce her ass. Grown into a fine young man. Take care of the family. Not that it's my concern, you know. I want it out. Guess he's just dead. <laughs> I couldn't save him. Dad or Pikachu. You got the bad ending to Detective Pikachu. Damn. You didn't complete what? enough side quests. He's okay! The pod? Dad! But, but why? Jim. Hey! How? Sorry, I kept you waiting so Dad! long. And... Why and how? <laughs> Easy now. You're gonna break my ribs. I'm so glad you're okay. Murloc's just in there Pikachu too. too. Yeah. I got him out too. Sound asleep. How did he survive? He really did a great job back there. Yeah, that was me, you know. Half you, maybe. <laughs> That's fair. Even a time to grab, like, the gem. Come on. Everyone's waiting. Let's go home. Yeah. We really not going to explain this? Well, he just survives. <laughs> Mewtwo's just like, my work here is done. What happened to the divorce? Fuck this game! <laughs> I'm so upset. They don't even account for how he survived. They don't explain the divorce! Why did he want a divorce? <laughs> There better be a post credit scene. Oh, this is so bad. What a dog shit game. Absolute dog shit. Like, this is so... Uh it's so unbelievably awful. Like, there's almost no redeeming qualities. It's, like, how did this get, like, a 6 out of 10 in so many outlets? How? It's... Did we play the same game? It's so unbelievably bad and tedious and boring. It is not fun. Children will not want to play this game. Why, why wouldn't you just... Like, 
What is the- why does this exist? You can just watch the movie! You could just watch the movie! What's the point? The movie's like- it's kind of like a fun, light adventure. And it's over in an hour and a half, which is crucial. This took like 13 hours! <laughs> this took 13 hours! They're bringing flower- okay, they brought flowers to the company sign, not even Emma's grave. They really never explained the divorce. I'm so upset. They just didn't address it. Uh Dodge Hunter Bits and yet there's a sequel coming for this game. This is the sequel. This is the sequel. Queen, thank you for 500 bits. Starry, thank you for 500 bits. Congrats for surviving some of the worst game I've ever seen. I think this is the worst game I've ever played. I genuinely believe this is the worst game I've ever played. I actually hated this. This is worse than Minecraft Story Mode, like, there's no contest. It's just irredeemably awful throughout. This is so bad. At least Minecraft Story Mode is, like, comically awful. You know, like, you laugh at it. This is just bad throughout. Like, Minecraft Story Mode had effort put into it, even if they didn't know what the fuck they were doing, and it was horribly wrong and misguided anyway. This- they just didn't care with this game. They just did not care. No one gave a shit about this game. There's more effort put into these photos at the end than the actual game. Is it really not going to explain how Harry's back in his own body in that? It's just going to drop that plot point. It's like, yeah, we're done. Her eyes nice for five could wait. That's not Ryan Reynolds. Please, for the love of God, give us a post credit scene. We deserve that much. Aw, come on, Dad. Please, take me on a case. I think I'd make a great detective. This isn't going to explain anything. I don't know. You get bored really fast. <laughs> What's that got to do with it? Sophia, you're still young, and detective work is dangerous. Aww. Go on, Harry. Tell her what it's like. Uh, Sophia, the thing about being a detective is... I could take your calls! Oh, maybe. Harry! I love how the door is constantly clipping out of its spot. <laughs> As the camera zooms in on it. They can't even get this right. Give me one sec, hang on.
Give me, give me just one second. Okay, yeah, I've, I found it. Okay, hang on. Wait, no, maybe I'm even hasty. Maybe there's something more. Hang on. I just, I just took it out. Maybe if I load it back up. Maybe. Just maybe. Load. Cast it into the fire! <laughs> Destroy it! Zelda! <laughs> oh, it just loads you back here. Great. Okay, I'm done. Well, I'm gonna go um, wash my hands and gargle after playing that game. I was Detective Pikachu's advice all along. What what a what an absolute piece of shit video game to sell in 2023. I cannot believe how bad that was. Absolute garbage. Existing purely to just like trick parents into buying this for their kids. That's it. That's the only reason it exists. It is literally to just exploit children. For their money. For their parents' money. That's the worst game I've ever played. <laughs> I hated this. Oh my god. Check out reviews. Uh, th the reviews are wrong. If the reviews are giving it 6 out of 10, I don't know what game they fucking played. It's so unbelievably boring. Like, if the reviews are giving it a high praise, then like... I don't know, they, they, they must enjoy like drywall on their toast in the morning. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Ah. Yeah, I'm gonna look into doing a movie night in future um, for Detective Pikachu because we can actually watch it because it's on um, like Amazon Prime and that it, you can actually do a watch party for that on Twitch. I'm gonna look into that for another day. I'm actually just so angry and upset and sick at the moment that I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go get some rest. <laughs> I'm just gonna get some rest. I just want to go for the day. But we'll look into that another day. The movie is just good, lighthearted fun. It's an hour and a half. It's actually not a bad movie. Uh, crucially, it is not 13 fucking hours long. <laughs> you know, and had actual production value and, dare I say, love put into it. Someone actually cared about the movie enough. Oh my, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. <laughs> okay, alright, no, we're just going. Thanks for thanks for watching, folks. Thank you everyone for sub. Thank you everyone for good bits. Thank you to the boss for being ahead. I'm going offline. Good night. <laughs>